Hello everyone! Welcome to our first little video. It's gonna be me, your host, your lovely, lovely host, and I'm gonna be here joined by the one, the only, Corenity. Now, of course, you guys don't know us, but we're going to try our best to be Minecraft YouTubers. You may know me um, from my previous videos. Well, not many people. But we won't talk about those old videos. So it's just going to be me and my lovely friend Karenity. <laughs> who, as you can see, is already being a little meanie. So I guess we'll start our journey by collecting some wood. I am usually used to playing um, Minecraft with controls on the screen, but for the sake of making these videos, I am using a keyboard and a mouse. So I may look bad at the game, but I am still experienced. So hopefully no one notices a difference in like the quality of the game, if that makes sense. So far, it's just a regular Minecraft world. We didn't add any cheats. There's nothing different about this world, anything special. We'll try to also gain some achievements in this world. Or, or at least try our best to gain some achievements. Oh, there's an apple. Oh my goodness. I've collected my first weapon of the world. <laughs> my first ever weapon. Oh, she has one also. Oh my god. She's already attacking me. How do I do this? No! Don't hide! <laughs> I, I forgot it was right click to throw an egg. Anyways, I believe we have- Oh no, don't be sad! Oh dear. I believe she has collapsed. You'll be okay. I forgot how I could pat you without actually hitting you. I think I think I'm able to do that on a mouse, but I don't remember how. Anyways, I believe we collected enough materials to start exploring. I guess we'll cut down one more tree just to be sure. I guess for now, we'll just kill some animals, specifically sheep, because that's what we really need to just get through this night. Hmm. As of right now, I don't see any sheep. I wonder... Oh, there's a sheep right there. I'm going to collect these apples, though. All right. The first wall of the world. Hmm. Oh dear. We have to start building a little hut right away. The world is already starting to turn the dark. Soon we'll be ambushed by meanies all over the place. Let's go, Faith!
Hiya. Oh, there's a spruce forest. Okay. I was hoping to find a flat biome. Hmm. Oh, is that a, a ruined nether portal I see in the distance? Let me just kill this shit real quick. But over there in the distance, I see a ruined nether portal. Uh, for now, I guess we can be on this little island here in the middle of this little world here. There's some more sheep. Oh dear, there's already a creeper. Uh, oh no, I hear the footsteps of a... Oh, oh dear. I was not expecting to encounter that. Uh, Faith, can you um, get the wool from the sheep? Or, I guess the creeper. Oh my goodness. I am not used to fighting things with a keyboard. Uh, I'm gonna die. No! Oh, dang. First death. I wonder how Faith is doing. Oh no. Oh dear. Oh, there's currently right there. Let's go. Uh, oh dear. Ah, maybe you'll assume this is my stuff. Come on, Karenity. Oh dear. Ooh, that was a close one. I only have two pieces of- oh dear, there's an Enderman. I only have two pieces of wool, sadly. Don't forget your apples, they're the most important. Alright, um, I guess for now we'll just start with a little hidey hole until it turns day. Um, yeah, there's a lot of diorite. Right? I think we got a little unlucky here. Diorite is good and all for building, but we don't really need it right now. It's way too soon. Let's see here, let me craft myself a little furnace. Oh. Hmm. Very tempting to make a picture frame, but I need to save my wool for a bed. And there we go. Let's see here. put you here and oh here's a little trick for some people who don't know um, you know how you can use um, planks as fuel well for some people who don't know because I see a lot of micro players do this mistake don't just put planks in the furnace as is turn them into slabs and the reason why you'll do this is because slabs have the same duration as full planks, but you're getting more out of slabs than you would planks. So you basically are able to smelt more stuff, you know, using slabs. I see Karenity took the initiative and started mining. All right, let's see here. 
There we go. Uh, now I can make a little torch. Do I need sticks? No, I don't need sticks. Where's the torch? Huh? I do not see the torch icon. I'll just do it old fashioned, I guess. And place it. Boom. There we go. We got light! Yay! <laughs> Alright. I wonder if it's day already outside. I'm jealous. I'll just take a quick look. Ah, oh, it is turning day. Still a few mobs outside, but at least it's turning day. I'll just put a trapdoor over our little hut. There we go. And this is useless now. How do I discard of an item? Oh no, the creeper's coming at me. Uh, did you make a sword by chance? There's a creeper on, on our way. Oh, Karenity, our savior! <laughs> Save me! Save me! Fun fact, for those who don't know, when a creeper already has a target in place, they won't attack another player, or at least for Bedrock, a Creeper won't attack another player until the first player it wants is out of range. So as you saw, even though I was attacking that Creeper, it did not blow up until Karenity got close enough. But don't be fooled, just because a Creeper has a target in place and won't blow up with you, if the other player gets far enough, it will see you as the next target and then blow up for you. As you saw, it just got attracted to me when I got farther enough from Kurenity. And that's the same with Iron Golems also. So one player can attack an Iron Golem and hide, and the other player can finish killing it. And the Iron Golem won't attack the second player who's attacking it, because it will be too distracted trying to get the first player who heard it. Also, a dark oak biome and la uh, ooh. I'm oh my god, is that do my eyes see correctly? Is that a cherry blossom tree in the distance? What is that? I see something like pink in the distance. Is oh those are flowers I think. Okay. Never mind. Anyways. I'm going to go explore the ruined nether portal. Uh, of course, there's usually never anything good in here. But I got a clock. How interesting. Now we can tell the time. And a fire charge. That's useless. I wonder where Karenity went. Oh, there she is. Oh dear, I need to start eating food. Hello there. Oh, you made some cooked meat. I should have done that. I don't know how to wave at you with a keyboard. How upsetting. I wonder. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. I did not know I could do that. 
Um, you can't see it on my screen, but I could just make everything on my screen just disappear. How interesting. Um, that does nothing. Uh oh, okay. Interesting. Nice. Also, thank you for the food. I guess we should start looking for some sheep. I don't know if you have enough wool. Oh, there's some little wolves. How oh, nice. I don't know if you have enough wool to make a bed. I'm just missing one piece of wool. But for those of you who are watching us, please let us know how this video is and let us know in the comments if you think there's anything we can do better. Oh, shoot. And if you like our videos, then please let us know in the comments also. I can't believe it. She's so kind. She's sharing her amazing gift of wool with me. Oh my goodness. You are truly kind. Now I can make a bed. Yay. Now we won't have to die during the night and also i should really make a sword and a pickaxe well i already have a pickaxe but a stone pickaxe let's see there we go that should be enough boop and a boop uh, i still need more for a stone X. And that, uh, Once you're done smelting that, I guess... Alright, so we finished pretty much gathering some resources in this area. Karenity is just finishing smelting some of her items. And then we'll just go to sleep as it is going to start turning night soon. And hopefully we'll... Just continue exploring and find a nice little place to call home. Usually when I start a new world, I like to go in the area where it's most positive. positive. So in this case, it will be somewhere around over there. But the spawn here is not so bad. There's a birch forest, a spruce forest, there's a dark oak biome right there, and who knows what more there is nearby. Are you done smelting? Alright, I see we still have some daylight. Actually, I don't want to risk it. We'll just set our beds down.
Let me sleep. Let me sleep. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> All right. Time for us to head out on a adventure. I just realized it would have been smart for us to make a boat. All right. Time to go. Uh how do I turn with this? Oh, I was pressing the wrong button. Okay. Uh, there we go. It's a whole new world. Fantastic places i never seen. Oh, it's a dolphin. We're going this way. I hope you guys like my amazing, beautiful singing. I feel like once I start editing this video, I'm going to cringe for my own singing. And I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more I wonder if I start singing random songs if I'm going to get copyrighted Probably not since I'm not, well, since we're not really big time YouTubers But imagine in the future I get copyrighted for this episode Because I keep singing songs I need to eat. Alright, wrong button. My goodness, I haven't seen a freaking jungle temple in so long. I am honestly shocked. I haven't seen one of these bad boys in ages. I honestly thought it kept, they just removed this from the game. Be careful, there's traps. The traps aren't really that big of a deal, but I think that they have um, poison arrows, so it's, yeah. Also, let me just light this area up. And this is a little code to getting a chest, a hidden chest. I forgot how the code works. I think it's this lever? No, I think that one doesn't do anything. I think it's that. this
and then this no and then there's a little open space opened up here maybe somewhere no hmm I know there's supposed to be like an open little hidden door did it open up now well then there's only one way to deal with this freak the freak the way the attended this to work I'm gonna do it my way <laughs> oh the new item the smithing um, templates wild armor trim how interesting this one is also wild armor trim and diamond horse armor and some gold um, I'll get some bones I guess I am mostly interested in this redstone There's another chest, but instead of going through the way the game wants us to go through, I'ma just do it this way. Haha. -ha. Oh, be careful. There's tripwire hooks. Um, I guess since I have the diamond horse armor, you can take the saddle. I'll take two irons, I guess. Oh, I also need to get rid of some stuff. <gasps> oh no! I'm gonna need to drop that. Oh, he took it. There we go. But wow, I haven't seen one of these things in so long. I'm happy we ran into this. But I honestly thought... What the heck? But I honestly thought it had poison um, tipped arrows. I could have sworn at one point they had poison tipped arrows in those things. Unless they just changed the back. really hates us oh my goodness oh wow what the heck meanie <laughs> thank you but that was real mean <laughs> you scared me here but I also want to make sure wherever we build a base that we have an easy access to a village hmm how peculiar
Well, hopefully there's a village nearby here. I think we explored far enough. You can only hope there's a village nearby. Anyways, this land seems good enough to build a little house. So we'll rest here one last time. Oh my goodness. This is now our new little home. Let's see. Oh no! I placed it the wrong way. Uh. There we go. Now then, now that we have a little place to call a home, I guess we can continue exploring at a different time. Oh my goodness, look, there's another cross over here. It's a cross. Coincidence? I think not. Oh my goodness. Rest in peace. Oh, so we're just surrounded by water here. Huh. Anyways, we haven't really done much for this episode. We've mostly just been exploring. And I already lost where I put our where we put our beds. Oh my goodness. Oh, there it is. But we haven't done much in this episode, but that's alright. We'll hopefully start mining and work on our little house eventually. But for now, this is where we shall end this episode. So thank you all for watching. And... I guess we'll see you on the next one.